Be prepared because till the end of this month you probably will be hearing so much about the latest Victoria's Secret show that you will get sick of it. But we need to be fair, the performances that were given on the stage were one of a kind this time. I mean, every time. Even if you are not a fan of the Angels, performers like Halsey, Shawn Mendes and Rita Ora are something to look forward to. Speaking of Rita Ora, who is she? Why is she famous? In this video, we will reveal some fascinating details about her career and about that time that no one actually recognized her on The Voice Germany. So stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe. Just to give you an idea of how no one knows her, there was a time when she tweeted saying dropping my new song Monday if this gets 100,000 retweets. And you know how many retweets that got? Yeah, 1,850. That was last time we checked. So how on earth did she make it to Victoria's Secret's runway show where stars like Rihanna, Taylor Swift, Lady Gaga and The Weeknd perform? To start, I gotta tell you that she's not even British. Rita Ora was born in Kosovo in 1990s, but they moved to the UK when she was only one year old. Her first singing experience was in her dad's pop, and then pretty soon she started being a YouTube sensation after uploading many covers of different songs online. In 2009, she even auditioned to represent the UK in the Eurovision, but pulled out because she did not feel prepared. Some people just have the luxury of choosing. The first big song that made her known to some people was released in 2012 with DJ Fresh called Hot Right Now. The song was a major hit in the UK and reached number one in charts, but still in UK. In the US, people were thinking she's the new Rihanna, as she was even copying Riri's music and style. It was later revealed that they even have an ongoing beef. Maybe we can say that her dating life and her racy pictures made her the hot topic. For the ones that don't know, Rita Ora used to date Rob Kardashian, and there was a time that she was romantically involved with America's sweetheart Bruno Mars. The rumors have it that when she was signed in Rock Nation, Jay-Z's label, Bruno was hired to write songs for her and that turned into a love at the first sight kind of thing. Well, if there's one thing that Rita is known for is her numerous fling rumors. Just saying. I mean, you all remember when Beyonce said he better call Becky with the good her on her sorry track from 2016 Lemonade and everyone thought Becky was Rita Ora? I'm just putting it out there. Rita was a judge on The Voice UK and after she left that show, she became a judge on The X Factor sitting alongside Simon, my favorite character. Despite this, she had a humiliating experience when she had a failed attempt to prank German The Voice judges. She was a part of the blind audition and when she was done with performing your song, the judges actually asked for her name and they said that she sounded just like the original singer of the song, which was actually Rita herself. Even when she introduced herself, the judges did not believe that she actually is the singer. Another thing that you may not know about Rita is that she's the honorary ambassador of Kosovo. As I just said at the beginning of the video, Rita was born in Kosovo and because she's one of the famous people who has come from there, the president of there granted the honor to her. For your information, and also for mine as well, this is a title given to citizens originating from there who have used their fame to help the recognition of the independence of this European country, especially by attracting media attention, which is exactly what Rita is great at, attracting media's attention. Like that time she wore a bathrobe at MTV EMA's red carpet? Only Rita can do that. You still don't know who she is, do you? This would be the best and the last shot, to be honest. If after presenting the next fact about her, you still don't know who Rita is, I'm not even sure why she's famous anymore. So you ready? If you are a Fifty Shades of Grey fan, Rita has played a tiny role in there. Remember Mia? That is Rita Ora. So yeah, she acts as well, which she is very proud of, by the way. And she also has a song with Liam for the last Fifty Shades trilogy, Fifty Shades Freed, called For You. The one that she sang at The Voice Germany, remember? That's the one. 
Let's not even mention the rumors that were around about her and Liam. So all this information, does it ring a bell? No? Why don't you help us and tell us the reason why Rita Ora is a famous one in the comment section below. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one.